Hi everybody, it's Diana Stanley at the Lord's Place and I hope that you and your loved ones are having a great week and that you are remaining safe and healthy. Wanted to update you on what we're doing here at the Lord's Place. As you know, this Friday, April 3rd at 7 p.m., we will be doing our Sleep In for Sleep Out. It's our virtual program. You can log on to www.sleepouttlp.org or go onto our Facebook and be able to participate in our program at 7 p.m. this Friday. We're very excited about this. It's a short program, as you well know, but we're really hoping that this will reconnect people and hopefully lift our souls and our spirits for, for a little while as we're continuing to struggle with um, the world that we're living in right now. So be sure to join us this Friday, 7 p.m. on our website. I also wanted to uh, let you know that we sent out an email earlier this week on different opportunities for volunteering at home. I hope you received that. Um, if you haven't, then uh, feel free to email me at dstanley at thelordsplace.org and we'll make sure we get you on our, on our um, email list for that. Lots of different ways that people can help us. Um, most of all, what we're really hoping for is that people are collecting uh, toiletries like we talked about last week. Um, if you have any soaps and toothbrushes and toothpaste and you can just put that together in a little bag and when this is all over, you could donate, donate that to us and we could then share it with our clients. That would be just amazing. Um, I also wanna take a moment, if I may, and do a big shout out to the amazing team at the Lord's Place. We are so blessed that we have um, a staff that is so dedicated and compassionate and passionate about serving the poor and the homeless. And this last couple of weeks has been very hard on them as it's been hard for all workers in the health and human service field. But a special shout out to my amazing TLP family. Thank you all so much for all that you're doing. Um, we are uh, continuing to keep everybody um, safe and that's our ultimate goal, but without our staff, we could not do the things that we do. So I wanted to publicly thank them for their efforts. Um, that should be it for this week. I will keep you posted um, each week just to let you know what's happening. In the meantime, stay safe, um, and we'll talk to you next week. Hope to see you on Friday at Sleep In for Sleep Out. God bless you.